Project 2 and back to Elizabeth Epic Mickey in the last part. We had successfully navigated the entire jungle. And I'm going to continue this through my, you know, my good run, which was that I, you know, had G Gentleman Starkey and got him all the way through the jungle without any enemies. So I can safely get to this blue treasure chest down here, which would actually be here even if you didn't destroy all the enemies. However, you have to probably you'd have to get rid of that uh, robot pirate we saw in the last part. Robot, oh my gosh, does that mean this could technically be Robot Pirate Island? That just occurred to me. Could we have finally arrived at Robot Pirate Island? Oh my gosh. My mind has been blown. Huh. Well, anywho. Sorry, I just had a kind of a little mind-blowing experience there for a second. So, yeah. Now then, there's actually nothing else we can really do in Tortuga. It's time we get to the big old pirate gate itself so we can head off to Skull Island. Where we'll most likely, you know, find Captain Hook somewhere, you know, bring the beat down and say, Hey, that's how things are going to be going from now on. More tickets, man. They are so generous with these. I love it. We'll have a, we'll have a thousand in no time again. Look at this. Boom. Look at all that crap. Okay. Now, however, now if you just talk to him, now if you do not get all the symbols, this is all that's going to happen. He's just going to say, yeah, I rallied him up. I took him down. And he'll just open the skull gate. Nothing really, you know, nothing new. Now, if you did get all the symbols, however, and all the, the pirates and talk to him, and put, talk down the spiders and push them down to the docks, made you distinguish yourself as some of the enemies. I'm making you an honorary pirate. Take this and all the pirates will know you're in it. So, yep. If you got all the symbols and got rid of all the enemies and talked to him, he'll give you the pirate hero gold pin. It's really nice. However, if Starkey didn't make it, talk to, uh, you know, our usual friend, Beluga Billy. He'll be up here on the roof saying, yeah, he's safe up here, and he'll open the gate for us then. Wow, that was a lot of complicated stuff that happened very, you know, a lot at once, but there you go. I'm right now working between three different playthroughs now, so you have absolutely no idea how time-consuming it was going into starting a whole new game and getting right back here so that I could film that little... 30 seconds of, not even 30, like maybe 10 seconds of footage. Gosh dang it, I hate these spiders! God, what the heck? That one just magic teleported me over there. No, screw it, I'm going over you. I'm not gonna be dealing with you. What's your trick? Oh, you wait till the right moment. These guys don't do damage, but they still stun me when I don't like. Alright, I can do this. So what? No, 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 no! Not one word, you spider. Oh wait, the film reel's up there. Can I jump up here? Aww. I think I see what I gotta do. Gotta jump over here. Get up here. Get on this swinging spider, which I just know is gonna screw me over if I even look at it the wrong way. And now let's just keep going. Hello, Mr. Turtles. Don't mind me. Parkour, parkour! Okay, now let's get out of here. Right now, before I lose my nerve. Finally made it. What the heck? Seems like we're kind of behind the scenes a bit here. This, all, this, this definitely doesn't look like Skull Island. Hang on, wait for it. That'll do. Hmm. Well, might as well follow this river. It's always gotta lead to the ocean at some point, and that's where we'll find Captain Hook somewhere. I mean, knowing him and his usual sailing bit, one would assume. Yeah, that's a little bit too steep. Let me try and. Uh, Get this going. There we go. My say since I was post contained sorry about that little cutout there. Uh, at that moment, the, thing, the video card accident kind of got bugged, but I fixed it. Literally, nothing changed. I swear to God, nothing bad happened. Well, you guys didn't miss anything. Just to get this. Okay. Let's keep on moving. Whoa. Oh, this is the ride, isn't it? Oh, you'd think we'd finally make it here. I seem to remember these pre pumping stone rooms. I only see one of them. Wherever they are, we'll have to fill them all up to get the ride working properly. Yeah, one would assume. Alright. Well, let's not be wasting time dilly dying. The whole place is on fire, and I don't. Well, I would not like to be around when the fire actually starts becoming real fire. All right, first let's get on up here. 
So now, as usual, as you can already probably assume, when we have paint and thinner pumps, we can either do the paint path or the thinner path. And as usual, there's always some really cool thing that can happen if we decide to, you know, do the whole paint path or the thinner path. Stay put. Okay, there's one. And you guys are starting to take more and more paint, and you guys are a lot quicker now. Okay. Everyone's all calm, so we're all it's a nice happy place. Happy! Okay. Thought I'd be something there. This is, a, this is a place a lot of people t tend to overlook, but there are a lot of good little goodies you can find here. Just gotta be patient enough to look around the place is all. Nope. Oh, oh. You know, I just realized it's probably along that little uh, awning right there. Find that little painted uh, window right there. Yep, there it is. Get back here. Then it's not gonna take you away from me that easily. Mere bronze pin. Sheesh. Man, we're gonna need to step up these rewards sometime. Sure as heck not gonna work right now. There we go. Oh, we're so close to a thousand new tickets, I can almost feel it. Cool. It's been a while since I've had a good healthy thousand. Well, you know, I always want down here. The first pump is really, it's really well hidden, but actually check this out. Boom. First paint pump. I'm gonna first do the paint path, because I gotta be nice, don't I? All the time. So yeah, we're just trying to get past the giant gate, but the problem is the thinner, as you see, is too high to let us comfortably slide down the gate. Uh-oh. Get him. Gotta love that long range. Okay, let's see what else I can find out. Hang on, maybe I can just spin this wall around easier. First of all, let me do the old checkeroo. It's in there. Anything over here, or is this just gonna be another one way path? It is another one way path. What the heck? Why would they do that? There's something, there's something hidden behind here. What the heck? Oh, those sneaky devils. Okay, there's the second pump. Now we just need the last one. And uh, as has already been said, it's kind of best to do it with only paint and with only paint or only thinner. No, I've never actually discovered what would happen if you did paint and or thinner. But I'm not going to take that risk. For now, let's get into that last pump. First, I'm going to fill it up with paint and show you the uh, results of it. Come on. Gotcha. Great job. Repair pumps to lower the river so we can get onto the gate. Hooray! So then we can comfortably, you know, just scooch right on down. I'm just get onto one of the boats as soon as I get some more tickets. You never know. Awesome. Hello, boat! Alright. So yeah. Now I'm gonna be evil and be a jerk. Because I want to. If you fill them all up with thinner, you do that the overload of thinner broke the gate. Now the river is rising. Basically, we just kind of overjammed the current a bit. Yep. And then I'll just go. Hello. Ah, sheesh. No, 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 no. Oh God. Okay. And either way, what's about to happen is going to be the exact same whether you lower the river or you lower the river. We're just going to be heading on to this gate. And you know what a wonderful, quaint little ride this was. Nice little throwback to the old uh, Gremlin Village. But sadly, it's over now. Hey, okay. hello, mate. Uh, so, um, don't mind me. I'm gonna be sneaking over here because I'm a little afraid of you. Okay, there's a grub over there. Leave your faith! Oh, did you? Oh. Okay. Get this far out of here. God. Okay. I don't have anything to give you, but I'm supposed to, I, I was supposed to free a guy named Rigger Green. Oh, he's in the cell right next to you. I'm really gonna share something. I know I would. See, I built a trap to capture some of Hook's mechanical pirates, but this fellow Green stumbled in. That's where I was headed when Hook's mechanical goon stuffed me in that cage. Sad about that, man. Just uh, free him up and we'll be all good. Awesome. My gosh, that was one of the, was one of the most scary jumps I've ever had to make, ever. My goodness, we haven't even gone to the worst of the platforming in this game. Oh, you haven't even seen it. Sup? I wonder what transpired with Captain Hook. Oh, you're the pirate that Horace Horse Collar was looking for. Don't mind me, uh, just getting some, uh, tickets. 
Never know what I'll find in here. It's a lot of one things. Not even a silver ticket. Oh, we just got 990. Oh my god. This better be worth a gremlin. So Sheesh. with all of this, it'd be worth something better than that. Alright. We out. These bars out of here. Too cluster. Over for that nonsense. And we got these dudes. Get out of here. I don't have time for you. Gotcha. You should totally have thought there'd be something. There. Oh well. And uh, oh shoot. Okay. Shoot. That is one purpose. I ask you. This is freaking dark cloud status. Why are these grinders here? If not to kill something. I'm getting out of here. Oh gosh, dang it. And then I got. Why is there an upper one? Who would need to be smashed to smithereens at any point on the ride? Security is not that tight at Disneyland to begin with. Maybe in the wasteland, but not here. There's our ride. Okay. Oh crap. Okay. Make any seven movements. There's our exit. I'm gonna go, and I'm not gonna delay. We got a thousand tickets. I'm so happy. Now, if you excuse me, guys, we're going to be going to Skull Island now. I'm going to go to Robot Pirate Island, because I would like to arm wrestle with cowboys on the moon. Actually, hang on a second. That chair is shiny. Looks suspicious. Aha! You were hiding a white ticket all along. Oh, dear. This whole place is falling apart. See, I don't remember much about the castaways. Oh, that's fire! That's a pirate. He's trying to hit me with a look like a, piece, a, a chalkboard eraser. Or a stapler. I don't know what he is. Alright, let's move on. Best to keep that rocket as is. Because I think... No, 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 no. Okay. Here. He's got to jump. No, no, no! Oh, no! Gosh dang it. Let's try get Ah! What the heck? Ah! Do not slap me and then hit me with a bolt with a mop? It's just mean. We're okay, running out of time. Running out of time! Dang it. Well, at least I'll be able to jump on the sail back now. It's probably an easier way. I'm just taking the long way if you're like doing it. Yeah, I know. Okay. There we go. Film reel. It's kind of hard because. You can't really press the A button to jump in front of this thing, because it's just going to keep giving you the dialogue. Oh well, we're making good progress, making good progress. Not too shabby, not too shabby. Alright, bring him on. Skull Island. This is where the pirate said Spee's boat would be found. Hmm. And there it- oh, shoot. Moment for a flag, we can use it to reach Hook. Uh, dude, it sunk. Uh, it looks like the anchor lines are keeping it submerged. I'm amazed it's still, it still would be, you know, saleable after being underwater for so long in the thinner. I have to locate the anchors and cut them loose. Uh, do you see a knife on me anywhere? And that's the machine that turns pirates into mechanical bots. Suppose we should find a way to take that thing down. Oh well. So this is it. The last area we get to explore before the big guy. First of all, a treasure chest that a lot of people don't really get, but takes a little bit of tricky platforming. Constantly keep jumping and- oh shoot! Okay, don't die, don't die. Find a piece of solid land that I can walk on. Come on, get me over to the land. There we go. Oh, and then just walk around here. And you see it? Holographic? Bam! You just have to get on top of this mount, but that seems to be easy for you. Just keep jumping and spinning and use your platforming prowess to get up. Nothing too bad. Alright. Got some boats, some rocks. Quite a little place this is. Alright. I'm gonna head over to that little cave first because we have to start finding anchors to cut them loose to get that boat back up and running so we can go out and sail after Captain. Where we'll find him? I don't know. How Mickey will know where to find him? I don't know that I know. All I know is we're gonna get out here somewhere. And somehow. Oh, there it is. One way to find out for sure is to cut it loose. 
Uh, it's kind of it's ungates. That might be a problem. Let me see if I can get up here and- Oh shoot, you had a guard up here too! Trying to ambush me, I see. Well, it's not good this time. Not today. Oh, this! I had a little bit of help with him right there. Lucky! Hit your gear! Oh god, awesome. That, now, if you excuse me, I have, uh, an anchor to get rid of for good. First, I'll deal with you twerps. You guys folding my plan. See, uh, it's kind of strange. The one now, the, the pirate guys we were fighting back in the boat ride had red eyes, while you guys have like green eyes. And they're like a difference of strength and whatnot. Anyway, there you go. Yes, this anchor was tied to that boat. See it rising? Now there are more anchors still hatching in remote places around the island. Eh, no problem, we'll just find them, bend them out, repeat, rinse, repeat, rinse, rinse and repeat. I think I said that wrong. Moving on. So now, about the machine itself. Um, when you return back to Smee and the other pirates in Ventureland, yeah, I believe the red light. When you go back, you know, I'm going to show this fight, because I don't want to have a good fight like this. Anywho, but when you go back to Smee and uh, the other pirates in Ventureland, depending on whether or not you got rid of, uh, that vile machine that's, you know, responsible for, uh, what's it, responsible for, uh, good thing of how to say this, uh, turning all the pirates into robots, yeah, I could have said that, you mean, I guess they kind of showed and told us, but, depending on whether or not you dealt with it or not, depends on whether or not you're going to, uh, have the pirates stay in Ventureland, because they're afraid of that the machine is still working, or, uh, come back to Skull Island now that the machine is gone. You can either destroy the machine with paint or thinner. It kind of looks cool both ways to do it. So I'm going to show that. But then in my third playthrough, I get that third playthrough in there. In the third playthrough, I'm also going to, uh, ignore. Because you also have the option of just not even dealing with the machine to begin with. Uh, however, if you do that then the, the machine will not work anymore and the pirates will be so afraid that they will not want to return to Skull Island and there will be some quests you can get if they stay and some quests that you can get only if they leave and the actual people who live in Ventureland come back. Ooh, it's a vicious blue rock! Awesome! Yeah, okay, 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 I knew about that already. That's what you get when you play this game a couple times. But now, of course, in my nice run, I gotta get rid of that machine and only use paint. Sheesh. Now that's a goal. Really. All that trouble. And then I see them out and I thin out and they give me a goal. But, gosh. Oh yeah, work them, have them work so hard, have them fight like 12 enemies at once. And then have them solve a puzzle, give them a silver pin. What, you just took out an entire room of bronze pin? What, you figured out that, that that was the mountain we were hiding behind? Gold pit, oh my god, how did you do that? You are like a god, like, no. God. Just give me the right rewards for what I do. But if you feel this will get maybe up with thinner instead, watch the machine. Behind it. It stops. The sheet's breaking down. I'll we'll have to use thinner for the rest of us now. Sadly, none of the transformed pirates can ever be restored now. Because the thinner will just shut down the machine. The paint, however, might reverse engineer the machine to make it turn the pirates back into humans. Why? I don't know, but it probably involves a really painful process, one of which I'm not I'm not at liberty to disclose to the viewing public, considering that my general demographic is is from the teen is like the late teens to maybe early twenties. I don't know. That's what I get for trying to trust YouTube for some stats and you know, just common sense for others. So anyway, let's get in there and take out that freaking sweeper who's trying to make messes for us. First, goodies. Love those green tickets. Love them. Can't get enough of them. Oh. Hang on. He's a wily one, this one is. Oh, dear. Can't catch me. Okay, maybe you did. Now you won't be able to. I got these bad boys a shield. You wouldn't want to get rid of this anchor, would you? That's like the whole reason I'm trying to stop you. Well, you know what? Too late. Get rid of this anchor and get rid of that gear. That will open my. That will make me escape. Well, don't! I guess there's only one more anchor over here now. What a really strong anchor that must be. Yeah, the freaking entire boat's force of buoyancy against it. 
on, let's keep moving. Not much time. Okay. Doing good, doing good. Not too shabby, not too shabby. Alright. And of course, before you even say it, no, there's still... There, there's, there's even a few more things we can get besides just... You know, stopping the machine and getting these anchors done. There's still more crap for us to do. But you know what? I'm starting to run out of time, you know, with the whole 20 minute thing. So, you know what? I'm going to fill up this pump with paint. I don't think anything really happens if I fill up the paint. And so, I probably will show it. Yeah, I do believe paint would work too. Other than that, uh, I'm Lucky Jack 22 and let's play of Epic Mickey, the next part. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to finish, you know, taking care of this machine, or if you want to be a jerk, and I'm going to get the rest of these anchors and finally do battle with Captain Hook.